Yo, this is Kenny E. Kenny Evans. Up in the building. We inside. Woo! Late video. But we're going to make it happen. Topic of this video is reasons to be honest with women. All right? Before I get into this topic, <clears throat> you know, I want to let y'all know this channel is all about helping both men and women be the best they can be in all aspects of their lives, their health, their wealth, their dating relationships, and the mindset. All right? So I appreciate y'all being here new people welcome returning viewers welcome i appreciate y'all if you have not already done so subscribe hit that notification button um definitely to help out with the algorithm if you just want to support me like the video and definitely share the video so we can get this information this video out to more people could use this information so we can make the world a better place for us and our future generations all right so i appreciate y'all for being here let's get into this topic here reasons to be honest with women you know it's very important <clears throat> Because a lot of guys are not honest with women. They will lie, manipulate, um, deceive. They will do what they got to do to get what they want from women. All right? So with that being said, women in turn inherit that too. And then they do what they got to do to certain guys to get what they want from men. You know what I mean? So it's a, it's a, it's a uh, really negative circle that happens. You know what I mean? And it's just like, at the end of the day, you know, you are what you attract. Birds of a feather flock together. So if you're honest with women, generally, they will be honest with you. Maybe not to the same extent, but they will be more honest than they would if they were with a guy who wasn't honest. Granted, they have a high attraction and they're normal, you know, women. <laughs> you know what I mean? So nothing really crazy with them mentally. So... Uh, that is all good. You know what I mean? So that's the reason I'm making this video. I'm going to give y'all four reasons to uh, be honest. And of course, the bonus at the end is going to capture everything, put a nice little bow, like a little Christmas gift, you know, you know, for the holidays at the end of the video. All right. So let us get this video really rolling. All right. First reason to be honest with women is all about being confident. Women will see you as being confident because, again, most men are not honest with women. They're afraid of their rejection, which is the big thing, because when you're honest, you give the woman the left or the right, the yes or the no, it's a black and a white. They could take it or they leave it. So you're risking rejection. Automatically makes you more bold and confident than most men. All right. Second part of that, you know, you stand out. Because again, most men are not honest. So they know you different. You different from most men. And they're going to appreciate that. They might not like you. They might not go for what you're, you're asking. But at least they will respect you for being different. And standing out above the rest. And being stronger and more confident than most men. Alright? So that is what that's all about. Second reason to be honest is women will know where you stand. If you're being honest, saying what you want, saying what you, you, you like, dislike, they know where you're at. They can't play, you know what I mean? They cannot do anything but go with whatever you're saying, you know? Because it's either going to be, again, they're going to be for you or they're not going to be for you. And that's all they can do, you know what I mean? Because... You are letting it be known what you want, what you, you know, what you like, dislike, whatever it is. You're being honest, you know, so they could take it or leave it. All right. So at least they know where you're at. And again, they're going to respect you for that. Third reason. Women will not be able to play games with you. Women will not be able to play games with you. You know what I mean? It's very powerful because... At the end of the day, you have to understand the fact that, you know, women, if they feel like they're being lied to or manipulated, um, they can do the same thing. You know what I mean? But you being honest, again, you're giving a, a yes or a no. They can take it or leave it. And all the extra stuff, if they don't give you an answer, you go leave them alone. They try to play games, you're going to leave them alone because you gave them the yes or the no. They can't do anything else, you know, so 
Uh, it's it's you know you get your uh, Alan Roger Curry, you know R.I.P. You know um, manipulative time race wasters. You know you get to cut through all that when you're honest. Women who try to manipulate you or trying to waste your time, then you know that's the beauty of being honest with women. You cut through all that and you get to where you want to go. And then again, they're not always gonna you know go with what you want, but at least you know. They're not down for it. All right. And of course, some will. So, yes, I appreciate y'all making it this far to the video. Definitely, if you haven't already subscribed, hit that notification button. Um, definitely like the video. If you like in the video, leave a comment. Let me know what you're liking and dislike in the comments respectfully. And of course, share the video if you like the video so we get this information. This video out to more people who can use this information, this video, so we can make this world a better place for us and our future generations. All right. I appreciate y'all. <clears throat> so the fourth reason, fourth and final reason to be honest in this video with women is because you are um, really being not only you being different, but you are having a standard for your life when it comes to women, you know. You're setting that standard that you have to be honest with women, you know, and with that, again, if they're normal women, if they're decent women, they're going to come back and do that to you as well. They're going to be honest with you. You're setting that standard. Like if they're not honest with you, then they're not going to be around with you, you know, and sure, it's going to take certain, you know, if a girl's a really good liar, it's going to take a little bit of time. But you'll be able to see, if you're a really honest person, you'll be able to see clues, little things that show that women aren't honest, you know, little keys. You learn in people, you'll see that people aren't honest, little things that they do, little facial expressions, little actions. You'll be able to tell little things that the words won't say, but their little actions and mannerisms will, you know, and you will be able to set that standard. You're honest, people will be more honest with you generally speaking, if they are confident and if they are normal people, because like attracts like. And of course, if you're honest and they still continue to lie, especially after a while, obviously you're going to let them leave them alone. You're going to leave them alone. You know what I mean? So you set that standard with women and then you're going to get that standard with women or else they're going to be gone. All right. So. Yes, yes, yes. I appreciate y'all. Thank y'all for being here. This is the uh, the bonus, bonus, the end of the video. I put everything in a nice little bow here. Um, wrap everything up very nicely here. And I appreciate y'all. The bonus reason is how come you should be um, honest with women is because at the end of the day, it is a leadership principle. It's a form of leadership. Because again, you're setting a standard. You're leading the direction of what, how you want the interaction to go. Your honesty is telling her, hey, this is where I want this to go. This is what I want. You could either be for it or you may not be for it. Cool, but this is where I'm going. You could either follow me or you could get, get lost. You know what I mean? So being honest is being a leader because you are telling the woman without telling her that you're going to follow what I want or you're going to go and by also by um secondarily you're saying hey I expect honesty I'm giving you honesty and I expect honesty if you want to deal with me long term but of course you got to be able to deal with the fact that if she doesn't if she's not honest with you you got to be able to cut her off you know but that's it's a leadership you're showing a direction of where you want the interaction to go not only in the short term but the long term you know, granted, you're consistently honest, which you always should be, especially if you're here, you're going to be consistent. You're not about the inconsistency. All right. So, yes, yes, yes. It is a leadership principle and shows leadership to women. All right. And that's the bonus. So I appreciate y'all making it to the end of the video. Um, like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification button so you know if I whenever I upload some new video, of course, share the video so we get this video out to more people who can use the information in this video. And so we can make this world a better place for us and our future generations. Of course, let me know if you like everything in the video, the list. 
Let me know you think everything was spot on. You think I missed something. Let me know if you disliked it. In the comments, of course, respectfully. You know what I mean? Um, of course, let me know what other topics you want me to talk about. Um, you know, I make this channel that I make it for you. So I want to know what you want me to talk about. All right? So I appreciate y'all who do let me know. Of course, um, donations are always very much appreciative. They're always, always very appreciative. Donations are always appreciated. They keep me motivated. Obviously, going to bring you high, bring you higher quality videos, and you know, only if you you find value, definitely donate. I really appreciate it. I guess that's all I got for y'all here today. You know, I hope y'all stay safe. I'll definitely see y'all next week. And always remember, the strongest person is the average.